Hey, welcome back to the channel with another great tutorial. Today we are going to turn this beautiful daylight shot into dark, cloudy night shot. So let's begin. I have downloaded few shots from envitoelements.com. We are going to trim this beautiful aerial sunset shot of the beach and make a composition. Adjust the trimming to get smooth shot and pre-compose the layer. Select the pen tool and draw a mask around sky. Now open the mask settings and check the box with option inverted. Adjust the mask feather to smoothen the edges. Now the foreground looks perfect. Let's just add the cloudy background to the shot and see how it looks. Let's check this lightning cloudy shot with foreground and see if it matches our shot. Drop this shot into our main composition below the foreground shot. Okay, so we have got rid of the sunset and background and changed it to cloudy night scene, but our foreground doesn't look good, so we need to apply the magic. Please create a new adjustment layer and place it on top of other layers. Search for Lumetri Color and Effects and Presets Panel and apply over Adjustment Layer. Now, apply the day to night LUT over this adjustment layer. You can download the free LUT from link given in the description below. Now, once the LUT is applied, we have a beautiful night scene of the beach, but our background doesn't look good. So let's try some other cloudy background for our scene. Okay, this seems to be perfect for our foreground. Let's adjust its position with our foreground. Now it's perfect with our scene. Hit spacebar and play it forward to check if there is something wrong. Okay, so our background is fine, but we need a little adjustments with Lumetri Color to match our background and foreground. Apply Lumetri Color to our foreground shot and adjust few settings under basic correction menu to match the scene. Now, apply Lumetri Color to the background shot and adjust the settings accordingly. Now we are going to adjust our foreground mask a little bit. Now apply camera lens blur to the background shot. We need to create the flash reflection of the thunder lightning over the whole scene to make it look realistic. So we are going to create a new solid and select a color from background clouds with a lighter shade. Now decrease the opacity of new solid so we can see the background and other layers and change the blend mode to screen. Now we are going to create the flash reflection by animating the opacity of this solid layer.
open the properties of solid layer and press the stopwatch icon along opacity to start animating. Add opacity keyframes between 0 to 15 on the sections where we have those thunder lightnings in the background layer. Repeat the process on the all lightning sections to create the natural flash docker reflection. Now we are going to draw a rough mask on this solid layer to turn this flash more realistic. Select the pen tool and draw a rough mask around the foreground layer. Now open the mask properties and adjust the mask feather so the edges don't look sharp. Now we are going to animate the mask path so the flash shape changes every time it flashes. Now select all the mask path keyframes, press right click and choose toggle hold keyframe. So finally, day to night transformation is ready and you can see the results. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and share it with friends. Thank you and see you with the next video.